below. In our current structure, we, we do have an existing um, <coughs> incomplete adobe floor, which is actually sort of a cob and concrete floor. It's, actually, it's, a, it's adobe mixed with a little bit of Portland cement. And we're going to finish that off. We're getting ready with our forms. We're going to take pictures and video of that. And as you can see, it, it does make a much more adequate floor of the dirt. So that's important. And uh, we're going to keep it wet. But still, that'll make a good supplement. Yeah. Put it in there, and I'll, I'll turn it in, and then we'll, we'll wet it. Probably Two. The other shovel. Yeah. Yeah, just probably enough. Give me three. Yeah. Three is like maximum. Here's another shovel. Two and a half. Yeah. Start mixing the dry ingredients. Picture or film? Filming. Oh. Well, mixing Portland in the local dirt. <laughs> Makes a pretty good floor, actually. Sarah, talk about the floor. It looks to me. Do you like the floor? I do like the floor. Is it fun? Hi, John. Explain our adobe floor. Uh, uh, our, our floor is consisted of mainly the local dirt, which is a very clay -y dirt. So it's about 80% dirt to 20% Portland cement, which is the bonding agent to make it stronger. Traditionally, I think they use um, straw and other things, but seems easier. And it seems to be working out pretty well. There's just novices at this, so it doesn't look as nice as other people. This is the but practice are, floor. Yeah, this is the practice floor. Hopefully by the time we do our own floor, we'll be better. It looks pretty good, though. Better than dirt. Way better than dirt. Well, it's not dirt. It's dust. <laughs> so you get this huge dust cloud every time the wind blows, and you get the white lung disease. So. Adobe way better than dust. 